Hi everyone, my name is Diana and I am a Watershed Ambassador for the AmeriCorps Watershed Ambassadors Program. The goal of this program is to promote watershed stewardship through education and outreach and to monitor stream health with biological and visual assessments. Today I'm going to be talking a little bit about a benthic macroinvertebrate called a stonefly. Now a benthic macroinvertebrate is a creature that lives at the bottom of a freshwater stream. Um, benthic means bottom dwelling, macro means large enough to see, and uh, invertebrate means no backbone. So macroinvertebrates are important for a uh, stream because they can tell you a little bit about the health of your stream. Some species are very intolerant to pollution, like our stonefly here, and others can live in um, streams that are very polluted. So there are many different species of stonefly, so coloring and shapes and sizes might be a little different, uh, but there is a few things that they all have in common. So stonefly nymphs are insects, so they have six legs, and their legs are segmented, so they bend. Um, they also have gills along their thorax, and it kind of looks like, like they have hairy armpits. They also have two tails, unless something was broken off or they were damaged, and they have their two antenna as well. And they are separated by their head, their thorax right here, and their abdomen. And here's a few pictures of some other stoneflies. So here's some coloring of this one. And this one, you can tell how flat the stonefly is, and that's just an adaptation they have to live at the bottom of the stream and resist any water currents, and to also cling to um, some rocks for camouflage. And here's another picture.